Let's write 0 0.48, the decimal 0 0.48 as a fraction. The first thing we can do is we can put 0 0.48 over 1. It's still 0 0.48, we're just dividing by 1, but now we have the start of a fraction. What we need to do is get this number here, 0 0.48, to a whole number. And we can do that by multiplying it by 100. I can see that we have one two decimal places. So two decimal places, we're going to multiply that by 100. So 100 times 0 0.48, that gives us 48. And that's a whole number. But we can't just multiply the numerator here by 100. We also have to multiply the denominator by 100. 100 divided by 100, that's just 1. So we're multiplying by 1. We're not changing the value, just the way it's written. So 100 times 1, that's 100. And now we have a fraction, 48 over 100. And we can simplify this further. Let's give ourselves some room. So let's divide 48 and 100 by 2, since they're even numbers. 48 divided by 2 gives us 24. 100 divided by 2 gives us 50. We can actually divide by 2 again, since we have even numbers. 24 divided by 2 is 12, and 50 divided by 2 is 25. We can't reduce this any further. So the decimal 0 0.48, that's equal to 12 over 25 as a fraction. If you divide 12 by 25, or 24 by 50, or 48 by 100, you will get 0 0.48. This is Dr. B, and thanks for watching.